Uh, Ms. Landberg, the statements need to be directed towards us. Okay. Well, he's here to hear. Last week he wasn't. Um, <clears throat> it's about the Tyler Tate arrest, the 17-year-old with Asperger's. You charged as an adult December the 20th, 21, with a terroristic threat and set a million dollar bond and you have allowed him to be bullied into taking a plea bargain of five years in prison or life in a mental institute. Quote by the inmate, an inmate that is in, was in there recently with him before he got transferred. He said, he has never seen a person that has been railroaded so severely by the system of Smith County in his entire life and he has been incarcerated on six different occasions and he feels like Tyler Tate should never have been arrested or prosecuted because he is a good kid caught up in the bad system. You know, he lied, Sheriff, about his arrest and at work and you searched his truck that was never there and found guns that was never there. And you know there are videos to prove his innocence of that as well as witnesses. You know the feds dropped the case for lack of evidence. The young girl's story was probably was a fake. You know it was an election year and you were under investigation. This was a great story for Ms. you. Ms. Bamberg, I'm going to have to stop you Why there because you you're still talking to Why did you take him off his meds for a few weeks? That's, that's against decorum and this is really not about the jail report. Yes, it this, is. No, it's about... It has to be how our, how, how our inmates are treated Ms. Ms. Bamberg, and they're not allowed a fair trial. I'm going to have to stop you there, but...